Welcome to Mishnah Stare Masechet Hala, Perek Bet Mishnah Gimal. Over here in this, in this Mishnah, we're going to discuss separating Hala while someone's naked or if they are impure. Right? So that's going to be the discussion on Mishnah. It's interesting because there's ramifications to, to all Hilchot Berachot. So Haisha, a woman, Yoshevet Vekotza Halata Aruma, Ipneshi Yochola Lechasot Tatzma. Right? A woman can sit and separate Hala when she's naked. Right? If she sits, on the ground, right? Straight, flat on the ground with her legs together. So her private area is covered, right? That's what it means. Right? Because when she sits in this fashion, right? Her private area is covered. But a man can't. Any which way he sits, stands, right? His, uh, his private area won't be covered. So it's interesting. It's interesting law, actually. And it's all, pertains to all the chot You see that a person is allowed to make uh, a beracha, right? Any, any beracha he wants, when he's naked, as long as his private area is covered, right? Um, right. So a man would have to cover himself with a garment. Um, there's actually a woman for way, way for her to say even without. So uh, just when it comes to kriyat shema and amida, there are different. There are other laws that you know. In addition to that, right? We can't have libo uh, see the erva. Or when it comes to the amida, it's supposed to be you know as if you're praying in front of a king, right? But other berachot. Right, that's the uh, that's the law. Misha enoya chula lasot isato betahara. Let's say someone he can't uh, he can't prepare his isa his, his dough while he is tahor. Why? While he's while he's pure. Let's say the uh, mikveh is, is is too far away. Right, it's 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 more than four mil. Right, about approximately four miles away ahead of him. Right, that's 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 way too that that, that that's more than hachamim are going to make him. Uh, travel in order to make his bread, his, his dough, um, while it's pure. So what could he do? Ya'asena kabiyim va'al ya'asena betuma. Right, what should he do? Make it small, make it, the, make it a shi'ur of kabiyim. Right, kabiyim over here, now Mishnah means smaller than the shi'ur of hala. And don't make it betuma. Right, better to make it smaller portions, right? And these smaller portions aren't going to be obligated in hala. And therefore, he's not going to have to separate halal. Better to do that than to make something that's going to be uh, obligated in halal. They're going to have to separate betuma. It'd be akiva omer the opposite. Yasera betuma ve'ayasera kabim. No, make it betuma, but don't make it kabim. Uh, it's interesting machloket between the two of them. Um, and Hanabam just points out when it comes to walking uh, forward, right? We make you travel uh, for meal, right? When it comes to going backwards. We don't even really make you go any go back at all uh, in the halachot, right? When it comes to nitzat yadayim, the chod nitzat yadayim, all this pertains as well, right? When a person needs to travel, right, and he's uh, you know he has bread that he wants to eat, he needs to travel up to four mil, you know, in the same direction that he's traveling to fi- try and find water to make nitzat yadayim. But going backwards, he doesn't really have to go back, um, only really um, up to a meal. That's what we'll say in the chod nitzat yadayim. Now uh, the Mishnah continues. Shekem shu kore the Torah, right? Rabbi Akiva says the same way you're calling something, you know, halat uh, Torah. So to you call it halat me'ah. Lazo kore halal l'shem. Lazo kore halal l'shem. We're both calling it halal. Aval kabiim em ba mechalek l'shem. If you make it kabiim, you're not even separating halal. At least if you're doing it betuma, you're still calling halal. You're still doing mitzvah, mitzvah, hafrashat halal, right? But you know, uh, if you make a kabiyim, which is smaller than the shiur, the measurement that's obligated in halah, so you 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 totally went around the mitzvah of halah. Right? Halacha is like Rabbi Akiva.